vision, real liberty, real justice, real equality, and real dignity. I wish you Egypt so you can tear apart the sheet with the multiple choice question, what do you want? For all the answers you're given are dead wrong. Your only choice there seems to be between evil and a lesser one. I wish you Egypt so you can, like the Tunisians, the Egyptians, the Syrians, the Assyrians, the Bahrainis, the Yemenis, and certainly the Palestinians, shout, no, we do not want to select the least wrong answer. We want another choice altogether that's not on your damned list. Given the choice between slavery and death, we unequivocally opt for freedom and dignified life. No slavery and no death. I wish you Egypt so you can collectively, democratically and responsibly rebuild your societies to reset the rules so as to serve the people, not savage capital and its banking arm, to end racism and all sorts of discrimination, to look after and be in harmony with the environment, to cut wars and war crimes, not jobs and benefits and public services. I wish you Egypt so you can fulfill your country's legal and moral obligations to help rebuild the ravished, de-developed economies and societies of your former or current colonies, so that their young men can find their own homelands viable, livable, and lovable again, instead of risking death or worse on the high seas to reach your mirage-washed shores, giving up loved ones and a place they once called home. You see, they're here because you were there, and we all know what you did there. Our oppression and yours are deeply interrelated and intertwined. It is never a zero-sum game. Our joint struggle for universal rights and freedoms is not merely a self-gratifying slogan that we raise. Rather, it's a fight for true emancipation and self-determination, an idea whose time has vociferously arrived. After Egypt, it's our time. It is time for Palestinian freedom and justice. It is time for all the people of this world, particularly the most exploited and downtrodden, to reassert our common humanity and reclaim control over our common destiny. I wish you Egypt. Thank you.